Javier Builds a Bridge, Chapter 8, A Second Crossing. Four weeks later, I packed three tuna sandwiches and one peanut butter and jelly without the crust into a bag. I let Louisa carry the bag, and I carried a backpack of juice boxes and bottles of water. Shh, I said, tiptoeing over to the cupboard where the birthday candles were. Shh, she answered. I picked up the cake that Mama had made for dessert. We left a note on the kitchen table and set out for our adventure. Several minutes later, we used a walkie-talkie to call Mama. I held the button for Louisa and told her what to say. Go to the kitchen and follow the directions. We waited for Mama and Joe at the front, at the foot of the new suspension bridge. It stretched across the river, hanging from trees and metal chains. When they saw us, they waved. Joe called out, What's this about? Happy birthday, called Louisa. Surprise! Birthday, Mama and Joe looked at each other. It's nobody's birthday, Mama said. Nope, but it's been six months that we've been a family together. That's like a birthday, I grinned. Let's celebrate at our fort. We marched across the bridge, one after the other. At the fort, we gobbled up the lunch, and Joe lit the candles on the cake. We all closed our eyes to wish before blowing them out. I had my fort back and a happy family. All my wishes had come true. I opened my eyes and watched the rest of my family. The end.